I remember my job when I was still in South Africa. Um, about five minutes from where I used to work, there was this empty field where I'd go and park my car. It was right next to the airport. You could see the airplanes come and go. And every day at about 12 o'clock, I'd jump in my car, grab something from the shop across the road and just spend my whole lunch break watching airplanes. And I remember thinking to myself, one day I'll be on that airplane. I'll be the one on that airplane and I'll leave this place and I'll never come back. And maybe then I'll be happy. When I'm a man, I'll be a blacksmith if I can. Clang, 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 all the animals. And this is the way that blows our street. I'll show you a horse so neat and tight. Then try down the lane to see if it's right. We're not a man. <laughs> So, I left. seeing quite a bit of the world over these past few years, I've come to realize that no matter where I go, there are always things that no ocean view could ever replace. When you've crossed all the borders and you've learned how to say cheers in all the languages, you'll always find yourself in that parking lot, staring out at the plains, wishing that you were somewhere else.